Cinderella, written by Jennifer Fandel, illustrated by Michelle Simpson. Once upon a time, there was a father and his daughter, Ella. Ella's mother had died. They were all alone. Ella, meet your stepmother and stepsisters. Soon, Ella's father remarried. Ella and her family did not get along. <laughs> Ella's stepmother treated her like a maid. Someone has to cook and keep the house clean. Cinderella, Cinderella. Ella missed her mother. I'm going to the market today, daughters. What should I bring you? Beautiful dresses. Fancy jewelry. Ella, what about you? I don't need much. What about the first thing that touches your hat? No pearls? No rubies? Only three dresses? Thank you, Papa. This is just what I wanted. Mama, here is a gift from me and Papa. I miss you so much. That night. The next day. What happened? We are here to grant your wishes. I wish for a juicy apple and a ribbon for my hair. Where have you been? The king is holding a fancy ball for the next three nights. Everyone is going. Zip my dress. Hurry, do my hair. Can I go to the ball? No. Please give her a chance. Pick out all the seeds in this flower. Then you can go to the ball. She'll never be able to do it before we go. Ella wished for help. Help arrived. Look, I did it. What would you wear? There's no time to fix you up. I wish I had something to wear to the ball tonight. Ella finally made it to the ball. Who is that girl? Look, the prince has noticed her. The prince danced with Ella all night. But as the evening came to a close... I must go. I'll walk you home. I can't let the others see me. I can't let him know where I live. What do I do? Good night. Did you see a girl run by? Your Majesty. Could he? Emma? The next day, the stepsisters dressed again for the ball. Did you hear? The king is looking for a princess for his son. Either of my girls would be a perfect match. Too bad you can't come, Cinderella. The sisters did not know how wrong they were. I wish... The prince spent another evening dancing with Ella. No one else got a chance with either of them. I need to go. I will walk you home again. Look over there! Ella escaped again. Hello, Your Majesty. That girl. She disappeared again. On the third night, everyone waited for Ella to appear. I wonder who this strange girl is. She should give other people a chance. Tell me your name. Who are you? Where do you live? I... I need to go. This time, though, the prince thought ahead. He had coated the castle steps with glue. Ella was able to get away, but she left a shoe behind. Next day, I am looking for the person whose foot fits this slipper. Did you hear that? Now's my chance. Which of my girls will it be? One sister's foot was too large. The other sister's foot was too small. Is there anyone else in this house whose foot might fit? Well, there is my daughter, Ella. Ella, come try on this shoe. It fit at the dance. Will it fit now? No! Why did you run? I was embarrassed. I'm not a princess. You will be one now. Ella and the prince were married. Her father came to live with them at the castle. And they lived happily ever after.